Pigeon Point Heritage Park is closed to the public. Sea swells coupled with rough seas battered businesses in the area. Owners tell Sea News it's the worst they've seen in a long time. Patricia Nicholson has details. By midday, the water swells at Pigeon Point had subsided. A drastic change from Tuesday night when waves came crashing onto the shores and into the bars on the beachfront. This area, usually littered with visitors, was as still as night, not even a lifeguard in sight. Businesses in the area were badly affected by the sea conditions and remained closed as a result. Owner of Renmars, one of the more popular bars in the area, said he'll remain closed until Saturday. Well, the night most of these things happen because it started coming, washing, and so I close and leave it. Take off all the current and I leave. So this morning I came and see more, 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 more and more damage. I caused some to it, but not as bad as, as now. One of the owners of Traditions Bar told us they've been cleaning all morning. They say it was the worst because it actually came into the bar. We were busy all morning clearing out all the sand and whatnot. And we understand that it's going to be worse tonight. But it's going to be about, we probably moved about what, a thousand pounds of sand this morning. So I'd rather move a thousand pounds a day than two thousand pounds tomorrow. Fishermen in the area are also counting their losses. We cannot complain too much about the sea because it got work. And what we need, we've been coming for years that we need a proper marina. Uh, things like these that you see happening there, the boat will be safe. Tourism Secretary Tracy Davison Celestine visited Pigeon Point and spoke with business owners. She said other divisions and agencies have been summoned to assist with cleanup efforts, but won't start until Friday, as she said more sea swells and rough seas are expected on Wednesday night. I already asked the Secretary of Infrastructure and Public Utilities to assist us in the cleanup exercise. Tima will also come to give us a hand um, in whatever way possible and then the Civilian Conservation Course. C News also understands Chief Secretary over London visited the area. Pigeon Point Heritage Park remains closed to the public until further notice. I'm Patricia Nicholson for C News.